Nice. Okay, prepare for bombing in. Well, hello, Shotokan Card family. Welcome to this little live class. We are on Zoom and on YouTube with people mostly from Northern America. And I'm here from Switzerland presenting you with a little class. First warm up, of course, we start bumping around. And while we do that, just bouncing around and we bounce backwards. So we have to make sure we know where we are in the room. Try not to look backwards, to watch your back. But just be mindful of your surroundings. If you're training in your living room, make sure you don't bump into your couch with your chairs. Or if you're on the beach, don't fall into a hole backwards, trying to activate our brains. The rest of the body is relaxed. Yes. So heels never touch the ground. And what we're doing today is we're putting our weight behind what we do. So we try to do this in a concrete, in an abstract way. Concrete, of course, really using the weight to increase our energy into a punch. And in an abstract way, working on our attitude when we present ourselves to our opponents in self-defense or in life in general. Good, switch to side bouncing. Now stiffen up your body, everything is stiff. Your abdominal muscles and relax again, the other side, but bounce around. Stiffen up. And relax again, we continue bouncing. Yes. Muscles start to become warm again. Stiffen up and feel the difference between relaxation and stiff bouncing and relax. Yummy, stand here, breathe. Nice. Left leg in front in the Gyakutsuki. Senku Tsudak. Ikite. Yes. And we do. Kmart, Gyakutsuki, while you bounce around. Let's make sure your twist of your Gyakutsuki is really nice. Ten more. Each knee, some she, go, look, you, catch, you, two. Stand here and breathe. Nice. Coming from below, warming up again. Feet just pushing yourself away from the ground. Ten times each knee. San, she, go, rock, sich, ach, chu, chu. Nice. We go for leg swings in Tenko Dutch, left leg in front. I wait for you. At home, yes, left ankle to touch, and each, and knee, and sun, and she. Keep your balance. Go. Rock. Sitch. Hatch. Here. And she. And switch. Right legs in front, ankle to touch, front stance. Ready. Hitch. Knee. Sun, she, oh, look, itch, hatch, chi, and chu. You may grab your knees and let's do knee rolls. Make sure your back is straight, yes, clockwise. And switch direction. So we're putting our weight behind what we do today after the warm up. 
Good, hands on your hips, shoulder width stance, and hip body rolls, slowly, carefully. Yes. So I can glance into your home doshas at home, if you're part, if you're a member of the GMAU, and we train together on Zoom. Of course, I can't see you train, give you corrections if you're on YouTube. And switch directions, warming up our core. Yes, nice. Now shoulder rolls backwards. Moving into arm swings backwards. Faster. And slow and switch directions, arm swings forwards. Faster. And stop. Nice. Stand here and breathe. Connect with the other people in the virtual Zoom room. We're all doing this together. Now let's warm up chest muscles with some push ups on the ground. Find your number, find your speed. I'm going to do 20. Each knee, sam, chi, go, rock, sich, hach, q, q, each. Ni, san, shi, go, rock, fitch, hatch, kyu, kyu. And on the back, yes, warming up our abdominal muscles with some sit ups, this time really slowly. And he, make sure your shoulders never touch the ground. And ni, and san. Shoulder blades never touch the ground. She. Go. No big movement here, but always having tension. Sitch. Hutch. Chew. Chew. And another five really slowly. Hitch. Knee. Sun, chi, go, and push up your hips towards the ceiling, towards the sky. <sighs> Doesn't matter where you put your arms, actually, on the ground somewhere, over your head, close to your torso. Do it the way you like your body needs right at the moment. Push up and slowly come down. When your hips touch the ground, push up again and feel your glutes starting to show that they're active in some way. And once more, slowly come down when you touch the ground with your butt up again. And yummy find a way with minimal amount of movement on your feet, turn around clockwise, straighten your gi, put everything in order, turn again around towards the class and two deep breaths. Hands on your hips. And left senkus dash, come it. We're starting to put our weight into our movement and we move senkus dash, pitch. So, what I want you to feel is you push your hips forward, your weight into what you're doing. Knee, so your hips move first and then you push them back. And mabate. Push yourself forwards from the hips up. Feel the weight moving into the motion. Knee. 
And she and Mamate from the side. Hitch ish knee ish mamate hitch ish knee sun ish and yame. Good. So again from your hands on your hips. I want to see the hips move first. I want to have concrete implementation of putting your weight behind it and an abstract implementation of having an attitude. I'm fully committed to this movement. Okay. Moving out with our left into Zenkutz Dutch. Hitch. Hitch. Yes. Explosivity. A knee. Hitch. Yes, and once more, sun. Yes, very nice. Yummy. Good. Walk around. Relax. Now, before we add our first arm, I want you to show me again from behind three steps. Go to the end of your home dojo and show me three steps where you actually put your weight into the movement and follow up with your whole body so that when we begin to punch and defend, we are ready with the whole weight. And Hajime, itch, knee, san, mamate, itch, knee, san. Yes, mamate, and yame. Great, thank you. Very nice. Still some explosivity missing here. So let's start with a little bit more explosivity here before we add our arm, hands and hips. And we start with our left. Thank you to Dutch. Hajime, itch. Explosivity. Ish pushes her forward. San, hai. Mamate, ish. Now what do you see? Your attitude. Itch, ish. Ni, hush. San, Mamate, ish. Yummy. And relax, smile if you feel like. Very good. Okay, let's take this energy and add um, a punch to it. Let's add Gyakutsuki from here. Thank you to Dutch Kamate. Rich and Gyakutsuki Kamate. So, left step out, right fist is in the air. So, let's not forget what we're training here. Focus is on putting our weight behind it. So let's not waste with time and energy with sloppy hand movement. This is our hips and our body weight moving. And each, yeah, knee, us, and sun, yeah, mamate, itta, pitch, and knee, ish, and sun, yeah, mamate, ish, ish. Okay, and from the front, once more we step out with our left, thank you to Dutch. And Gyakutsuki Kamate. And Hitch! Yeah! And Knee! Yeah! And San! Yeah! And Marate! Ish! Ish! Gyakutsuki Kamate! Hitch! Us! Knee! Ish! And San! Ish! And Marate! Ish! And Yame! Very nice. Good. Show me your Gyakutsuki with your body weight behind it. Add some explosivity if necessary. And then Jimmy, itch, knee, sun, and mamate, itch, knee, sun, mamate, yummy. Thank you. Good, good. Let's take away the putting your weight behind it and let's go to a little static Kihon drill with Tsenkutsu Dutch uh, Oizuki. So we have a right Tsenkutsu Dutch with our right leg in front. We have to work on our explosivity a bit here, guys and girls at home. So we have our left fist in front, our right foot in front, and we do Oizuki. Hitch! Knee! Hitch! 
Explosivity. Sun. Ish. Chi. Ish. And go. Ish. Yep. Hitch. Hatch. Q. Ish. And chi. Ish. And yummy. Deep breathing. Same thing on the left. Left. Thank you to touch. Left. Foot in front. Right. Fist in front. Left. Fist nice. Ikite. What I want to see is nice preparation with your hips. So when we do an oizuki, see my hips now whipping out the yakutsuki, whipping out the oizuki, whipping out the yakutsuki. See that? So I want to have your hips involved here. This is static drill, but I want to see how the, the movement, how the weight of your hips is behind your tsuki. And hajime ich, and knee. And sun, ish, and she, ish, and go, ish, and rock, ish, and sit, ish, and hatch, ish, and key, ish, and she, ah! Yeah, it's very nice. Good. Prepare your gloves. Um, if you have a bag at home, we're gonna do some back work here, putting our weight behind this. I'm going to train on Bob today for this. My nice little confident training partner here. Thank you, Bob, for sticking up with me here. Yes, everybody ready on your heavy bags. And to do static key hunt drill. Left senku to Dutch. And Kakutsuki Kamate. Let's try to stay upright, have a good. Measure of distance here and hitch, ish, and knee, ish, and sun, ish, and chi, ish, and go, ish, and rock, ish, and hitch, and hitch, and chi, and chi, ish, and switch. We have a right ankle to touch, a right kyakutsuki, and hitch, and knee, ish, and sun, ish, and chi, ish, and go, ish. Thank you, Bob. Thank you, heavy back. You can leave your gloves on and put them away. Another round of dynamic key hand drill from the back of your dojo. Put your weight behind it. Increase the strength, the tension of your abdominal muscles so that your whole torso moves in one line. Yeah. Explosivity, come on. Knee, hi, ish. The sun, and she, mamate, ish, ish. Gabutsuka kamate, ish, knee, ish. And sun, and chi, yeah, and mamate, yame. From the side, if you have a big dojo, otherwise, show me from the front again. Put your weight behind every punch. Chich, hiya, knee, yes, and sun, yes, and mamate, hitch, and knee. And Sanda! And Marte! And relax, Yasme. Walk around. Little break here. Give me a thumbs up. Did you get a different feeling here? Give me a thumbs middle if you fail, fail to. Yeah, we have some thumbs up here. So the point is just have a good engaged abdominal muscle group here so that we push ourselves forward into um, the punch here. Let's continue with Koko Dutch from the front. Koko Dutch, come at it. Koko Dutch, putting our weight behind it. We have 70% of our weight, body weight on the back foot, moving through 
but putting our weight into it. Hitch! Hitch! So we have explosivity. We have determination. We have abstract um, way of putting our weight, our whole existence behind this. Knee! Hitch! And sun! Yeah! And mate! Hitch! And itch! Hitch! And knee! Hitch! And sun! Yeah! And mate! Hitch! And one more round! Hitch! Yeah! And knee! Yeah! And sun! Hitch! And mate! Hitch! And knee! And sun! Ta! Mate! And yummy! And great! Yes, me walk around, relax. I walk around towards the back of the dojo and show me your Coco to Dutch with your body weight and your intent behind each and every step. And wait. Coco to Dutch, how it is. And reach. Knee. Sun. Mate, hitch, knee, and sun, and mate, yes, yummy, and rip. Of course, we always have to go deeper, wider, longer, well, not wider, in Coco's Dutch, but you know the drill. Let's go into Renoji Dutch. So we have half. Long stance, left leg in front. Prepare for Stoke, Shutoke. In the lower level, we say with the right hand, we mark the target. With the left hand, we cover our ear. The elbows meet here. And each. And knee. Stoke. How can we put Ishsan, our hips into motion here, helping the movement? She. And go. And each and knee and sun ish and she ish and go ish ish. You see, I've looked, I've walked a bit closer to my bob just to show you one little bunkai here marking the target. Of course, marking the target with your hand, one hand that's something we can look at, we can think of, but we can also think as of like hitting our opponent into one of the soft spots here. Ish, ass. Ish, ah. ish, ish. Looking at this as being an attack. So we have to put our body weight into this motion. Attacking here ish, and attacking here with the shoot though, with the, with the knife hand part of our fist into the neck area. Good. Right, Renoji Dachi, same thing on this. And we think of it as being attack, left marking the target or hitting the throat area here. The right arm covering your ear, yes, and each and knee, ish. explosivity, ish. sun, chi, ish. explosivity is much easier to think of when you think of this being an attack. Go and rock, and each and hatch, ish. and chi, ish. and go, ish. and each knee, ish. sun. Ish. She, ish, go, ish, rock, sitch, hatch, she, ish, she, da. Nice. Again, little Yasme, show me your stoke, your static stoke drill before we put this together in Kokuz Dutch. Renoji Dutch, come at it. Stoke, come at it. And each. Me. Sun. She. Go. And switch. We have a left uh, Renochi Dachi now. Make sure that the hand that retracts, so after the attack, is on solar plexus level here. Uh, some of you uh, guys and girls at home have them a bit like at, at, the, at the lower stomach level. Let's keep it up here. It's also designed to um, prevent being attacked in the solar plexus area. Good. And each, knee, sun, she, go. Nice, stay in this position. 
Good. Then turn around 90 degrees because what I want you to do is I want you to think of being in a close range fight. So if, if I fight against the thin air and my imaginary opponent, I always do this. I go out because the imaginary opponent is somewhere here. But if we're thinking about a close, close range fight, we are here. So this here is really a small angle. The arm that goes out is really, really close. So we're hitting here and this is all very close. Ish, ish. Let's go here and try to have this uh, 90 degrees or even less. Show me from the side. Renochi Dachi. From the side, please. Good. Second thing to work on. I mean, this all looks really good. Let's try to take out a bit of speed and add some hip movement here. Because I really want you to have your weight behind the shoke, the shutoke. So on each. Hips, yes. Knee. Sun. She. Go. Rock. Sitch. Hatch. Q. Have your arm close. And G. Yes, 90 degrees after execution. Like uh, your hands should be at about shoulder level. Yes, that is much better. Good. One last thing we can look at before we move into a dynamic key home drill for this. Yasme, relax. So, on preparation, we are in Renochi Dachi. We are here. Our hips, our torso looks forward. We are here, square to our imaginary opponent. Attack. Prepare our hands or cover our head, whatever you want to do with this. Bunkai. But we are square here. If you are like restricted in your flexibility, then maybe you have too wide angle here stance or a too long stance. Make sure you're square here. Okay? And when we go out near each, at the end, we're facing sideways. So there's ish, a lot of hip movement involved here. Okay, so the next round of 10 stoke on each side, I'm gonna take part with this with you. I want you to focus on having square hips in the preparation and on second explosion, yeah, we have hips to the side, okay? Ish, good, and prepare, stoke kamate, and each, and in, ish, and she, ish, and go, ish, and rock, ish, and she, ish, and that, ish, and you, ish, ish, and G, ish, and switch. Prepare. We have, again, square hips here, yes. This is an attack. And each, and knee, ish, and sun, ish, and she, ish, and go, ish, rock, switch. Hatch, keep it close. Hew and you. Da. Stay here. Breathe deeply, relax. Without losing your focus, your attitude, and you may. No wobbling around. Very nice. Great. Good concentration, team. Go to the back of your dojo. Yo. We put this together. Coco to Dutch back stance. We stroke, and this time. We lose everything else except for the thing we're actually here for, namely putting our weight behind this. Because like all these technical intricacies, these details, they're not important if you if your if you, if you punch, if your deflection, if your attack using your shuko, shutouke doesn't have your weight behind it. So we have kokutsu dachi kamete. Left kokutsu, uh, right kokutsu dachi, left leg is in front. And we start with one kokutsu dachi and one shtouke and step through each. Hiya! Explosivity. Little break. Knee. Hiya! And sun. Hiya! Yes, mamate. Hitch. Hush. And knee, hush. And sun, nah. And mabate, nah. Of course, in mabate, of course, you first turn your head. You want to see your opponent. One more round. Hitch, hush. Knee, hush. Sun, hush. Mabate, hush. Hitch, hush. Knee, hush. Sun, nah. Mabate, whip. And yummy. Right. 
C'est ça Donc so, close your eyes, three deep breaths. So yummy, open your eyes and read. Respect to the class. Before we move to the highlight of this class, go to the back of your dojo. We do two rounds of Yakutsuki. First round, I'm with you. Second round, I observe you. Another two rounds added afterwards of Stoke and Kokutsu Dutch. And we put a weight behind the movement in the concrete way. We move into, explosively into the feeling, into The, the movement into the technique and also figuratively, like abstract, with our attitude, with the way we present ourselves. And first, right? Relax. Get Thank you to Dutch. They need Oitsuki Kamate. And first round, Oitsuki. Pitch. Ash. Yakutsuki, sorry. Knee. Ush. Sun. Ush. Mamate, push, push, Yakutsuki, Kamate, and itch, push, knee, and sun, Mamate, push, push. Now you show me your Yakutsuki and hitch, knee, attitude, come on, sun, yes, Mamate, also Mamate, explosively, yes, and itch, and knee, sun, Mamate. And yame, but keep your attitude in yame. This is not yasme, this is no relaxation. From here, we go into a right kokuzu dutch. So we put out our left foot, stoke each. Good, now on each we step through, putting our weight behind it in the abstract and concrete way. Hitch, ha, knee, hush, sun, hush, mamatil, hush. Hitch, knee, hush, sun, knee, hush. Now stay in this position. Show me how you put in your attitude, your energy, your weight behind the movement. And itch, knee, sun. Look at the hand moving forward as an attack. This is too slow. I want explosivity here. Mamate. Yes, hitch, knee, attack, sun, and mamate, and one more round together with me. We have a right ankle touch, a cocoa touch, the left leg is in front, and hitch, push, knee, push, sun, at the youth, come on, mamate, push, hitch, knee, push, sun. Mate, push and yummy. Stand in the middle of your dojo, relax. We do focus and recharge. And right. Thank you, class. Thank you, Shotokan Karate family, for this awesome class. I had big fun. I hope you learned something too. For those in the GMAU, stay in the Zoom class. We'll have a quick chat and see what's going on afterwards. Maybe, maybe we're going to add another class here. You can also unmute yourself so we can have a discussion. For the ones on YouTube, see you soon in one of the next classes. Us, take care.